Froggy, 99.9, talentless but so friendly. It is Scotch, Tank, and Mandy. We hear that all the time. People are like, they make me feel like I could do it. Yeah, yeah. that's the point. Uh, it's game time, game time. We got that this or that game of choices where you must choose. We call it Would You Rather. <laughs> Who wants to get us started? You just jump right in. Okay. Would you rather not get your I voted sticker on election day or be the last person to walk in and make your vote, making all the volunteers wait and watch for you to leave? You still get a sticker? You get a sticker that time. Yeah, I'll do but that. You, you like the sticker? I like the sticker. You put it on your forehead like you put your Chiquita banana sticker? I put it on my right arm. Oh, no. <laughs> like a, a ta- tattoo. Like a tattoo. Uh, yeah, I don't want to be the last one in the polls, you making don't? everybody wait. I don't know why I enjoy the sticker so much. It's just like, I. it proves to me that mm. I did it. And I need that. I don't need, need the, proof. I don't need the verification. I, I can live without the <laughs> sticker. You're a good person. How about this one? Would you rather walk across the USA in a vicious hurricane of meatballs? Okay. Or have to have Paris Hilton narrate your life? Oh. Uh, possibly hear her over your shoulder. Can you eat the meatballs? And then Mandy walked into the store. That's more of a Kim Kardashian. It idea. is, but like I I think I would be entertained by Paris trying to explain everything that I do. Yeah. Because I don't think she knows how to do everything I'm doing. Okay. And then she's like talking on a microphone. Yeah. I don't know. And to answer your question, yes, you could eat the meatballs. I'd eat my way out of the hurricane. Oh. I'll take the meatballs. Now that's some good thinking. I love it. But there are no wrong answers here. We got one for I each, I guess. I love it. Are you Her- the tiebreaker? Well, you know, I, I've i never seen a vicious hurricane of meatballs, and I think I'd like to see one. So I'll, I just, go, with, I'll go with the meatballs. I like to feel clean, and I feel like meatballs is just going to have marinara okay. sauce all over me. That's why I'm choosing Paris. Okay. What if they're like in that mushroom gravy? What if they're <laughs> Swedish meatballs? It's it, still, I, it doesn't feel <laughs> clean. God, feel like, I feel like I'm in Ikea. Just saucier. Would you always rather smell like garlic or a wet dog? Oh, man. Oh, garlic, man. garlic. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I hate wet dog, mm-hmm. especially in a car. Yes, the only thing worse than that is up dog. Up dog. What's up dog? I don't know. What's up with you? Oh, oh geez. Geez. <laughs> walked right into that one. <laughs> and with that, we should put a leash on you. We'll take a little break, and when we come back, we'll have more. Would you rather's? I'm Froggy ninety nine point nine. All right, Froggy, 99.9, one of the top 13 morning shows in the FM area. We are right in there. It's Scotch, mm-hmm. Tank, and Mandy, and we're playing another round of Would You Rather. I heard we're closer to 13 than 1. you got to be on one side of the spectrum. And we're know? fine with that. <laughs> right, and we are definitely on the spectrum. Here's a question for you. Would you rather join the circus as the world's ugliest person attraction oh. or... Star in a reality TV show called I Killed My Family. <gasps> oh no, those are really hard. Neither one is um, pleasant. What's the circus one? You'd be the world's ugliest person attraction. So that means you're traveling the world. You get to see a lot of things, yeah. maybe. Yeah. Maybe. I'm a pretty ugly guy right now, so I'd go with that. I have no problems. Cool. Now I'm so invested in the circus thing. What was the second part? Would you rather star in a TV show? Oh, oh that I killed my parents. Yeah, I killed, killed my, my family. You know what? I, yeah, circus it is. Here we go. I can't kill people. Yeah. I can barely kill a fly. I'm with you guys. I'm not a killer. And, you know, you're there lover. might be some circus groupies out there that don't even care if you're the ugliest person. They'll be like, oh, I got with a circus performer tonight. Maybe the bearded woman is available. Maybe. <laughs> Imagine what your kids would look like. Werewolves, little the werewolves. ugliest person and the okay. bearded woman, <laughs> hairy and ugly. <laughs> Who's would hairy? You, would you guys rather gain an extra hour of sleep or an extra hour of OT, like the money? That's time and a half. Overtime. Overtime. Oh, I'm a salary guy, so if I work any extra, I don't get paid extra. So, yeah, I'll, really, I like the hours. What of about sleep. like the events? Right? Don't you get paid extra for events no. that we do? Well, I'm never going to be salary. <laughs> Tank what? just does it because he loves the job so much. Yeah. He's like, sign me up. I'd love to do that. <laughs> Work the crap out of me. I'm a real glutton for sleep. I love sleep. I think I'd rather take the extra sleep. Sleep is what I should say, but I'm totally doing the overtime. Ooh, you work hard for the money, girl. Gotta get that dollar. 
Would you rather have every meal you eat for the rest of your life be too spicy or too sweet? Too spicy. It makes me really sad when it's too sweet and I can't handle it. Oof, overly sweet is just yeah. noxious. Like the gut rot feeling? I'd I rather want, have the spice. Yeah, I want spicy. <laughs> I don't know. I had some chicken wings the other night. They were too spicy for me. I couldn't do it. Really? Yeah, I had to give it up. I don't know what happened. Oh, you baby. Tank oh. man. Yeah, he's usually a tough guy with the spicy wings. Yeah, not... Danny is talking about maybe bringing a client to the table that might do a little wing challenge with us. Would you be down? Go ahead. You know, I mean, you'd have to do it, too. Let's we, watch you. We'll we cheer you on. Go, you. Go, spicy, go. Play hot in. ones. You've done the hot ones, so you're God. you're ready for it. I'll jump in for you, Tank. Uh, we'll take a break. Oh, boy. You know, I go head-to-head in a yeah. wing-eating contest. Now that's a party. <laughs> we got more coming up on Froggy 99.9. More Would You Rathers next. Can't wait to have my mind blown. No, oh, it's going to be blown to pieces, baby. And those pieces into smaller pieces. Woo! Well, look at that. Like a dog returneth to its vomit, the wake-up call is back. Scott, Yay. Tink, and Mandy. Hey, we're playing another round of Would You Rathers. Who wants to start us out? Would- Go ahead. Oh, me? Sure. Okay. Would you rather chase a turkey <laughs> or the next-door neighbor's dog that just got out? Turkey or puppy? Puppy or turkey? Come here, turkey. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Is it a wild turkey? It's like one of those turkeys you can find in North Moorhead, because thats I feel like that's where I see them. I thought you meant like at Rick's Bar. Yeah. I'll take I'll a, a oh. wild turkey there. Full handle of wild turkey. <laughs> yeah. Three fingers of wild turkey. Free pork Send it my way. <laughs> yeah. And a dog might turn on you and bite you. Then again, those turkeys are pretty nasty, too. I know. Oh. I think it'd be funnier to do the turkey. I'd bring a cleaver with me and... We're close to Thanksgiving. <laughs> That'd be can... a sight in the neighborhood. You running around behind a turkey. <laughs> Come, back here. <laughs> Come here, you little turkey. Would you rather wear full scuba equipment whenever you leave the house? Got to put on a scuba suit. Oh, scuba geez. Steve. Or you're a billionaire, but you projectile vomit every time you spend money. <laughs> That'd be great. You get all the money in the world, but you're like, I'll take a large coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations on the purchase of your new yacht. You just throw up all over the guy. Yeah, I'd do that. Be my really? calling card. Yeah. You would, huh? Oh, why not? I just feel like the wetsuit, I'm always cold. That will keep me nice and, oh. you know, insulated. Sure. The wetsuit's the way I'm going because I can't handle, like, people wouldn't want to hang out with me. It's all right. You're a billionaire. That's true. I yeah. could just. You could buy your friends. <laughs> Oh. Those scuba suits, I guess, are a good weight loss method. You do a lot of sweating in those. Oh, do you? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. See, that was the other reason. All right. Duh. Good weight loss method. Would you rather have to always say everything that pops into your head or never be able to say what you feel? I feel like I do the first one always, anyway. I always say everything that's in the top it's of my head. No filter. Diarrhea of the mouth. Yeah. I do the la- later. Just ask my wife. Just bottle up your feelings. Yeah. You are such a guy. Yeah. Just tell me how you feel. Why? When I can just hold it in and then just let it all out and once with everything. Because one day you're going to blow up and it's going to be the worst for everyone involved. And no one's going to know how to pick up the pieces. Ah! Oh, I'm speaking cool. from experience. Oh, we just watched Tank explode. It was pretty <laughs> awesome. Mandy and her psychobabble shooting her mouth yeah. off again over there. Psychobabble. <laughs> No, no I think I'd rather uh, just uh, be spewing the first thing that comes to mind, too. I don't want to bottle up my feelings. No. I'm a softy. I'm a, I'm a today's man. It makes your tummy churn. I'm one of, those, uh, one of those uh, softies. What do you call them? Soft serve? Softy buns? Ice cream? <laughs> one of those soft serves? No. <laughs> anyway, that's no. good enough. Is that it? Yeah, that's it for we me. All, we all did our I, part? I, yeah. Okay, great. Oh, look at Scotch as a twist cone over there. Do we all feel the better for Love it? Sir. Great. Grand. Wonderful. More coming up with Scotch Tank and Mandy and Froggy <laughs> 99.9. Hey, soft serve. Because you're soft like a crab in summer. Now, don't go getting soft on me.